you can just imagine the scale of 20 years plus occupation, 380 rock mines, less than four years of work. And that's what only Project Masam have encountered. We're not counting you know, rock mines being found by other, you know, by military engineers, by, you know, uh, the giant brigades or anyone else. This is just Project Masam. Nowhere in the world have ever used so many IEDs in one place. So we were finding these mines, these Claymore mines, which are designed to be placed like this and shot out like that as a, as a military ambush. We were finding them in the ground like this with those pressure plates in front of them so if one person stepped on them they would be literally ripped apart by the blast i have never seen that in in all the depths of war depravity that, that i've seen i have never witnessed that uh, uh, that that improvised usage of a, of a claymore, uh, claymore mine. Where it is in that picture, that picture is a school. That picture is a school. And during during a time that, that El Hofi occupied that school, they dug up the floor, they lifted the floorboards, as you can see, the tiles, they dug up the ground underneath and they placed this charge inside this school and then they covered it up they put the tiles back and then they ran wires through the walls of the building and covered them with cement so that they could just attach uh, an initiation device to that anytime and blow the whole school up we now find these routinely and regularly uh, in, uh, in, in Yemen. Not only that, the general size of them, if you can see, you can see where the, where, where the mass anti miners are, 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 are moving, you, you get a sense of the scale of them compared to his hand. That's a normal size for them. If you look at the picture in the bottom, you can see it compared to the legs of the de miners. So the Houthis are also producing ones this big. Like a, like a small dustbin. Never, no one has ever produced a mine like that. And these are all homemade. These are all made by, by, the, by the, 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 the Houthi forces. So it's a deliberate thing. Most of the casualties are either old men, women or children. Their own villages, or the fishermen villages on the west coast, going to school, going to the hospital, using a desert road. Hurting in agricultural work. That's where all the accidents are happening. El Houthi did not leave one spot of Yemen that he has not planted, used landmines or IEDs on those areas. Those victims have no idea what they're encountering and what's going to happen. So to date, as of the end of the last month, we have cleared, the, the, the project has cleared 120,000 anti-tank mines. Almost 5,000 anti-personnel mines, over 7,000 of the IEDs and the rock mines that, that Osama was mentioning, and another almost 200,000 items of UXO, unexploded um, or ordnance. If you took every country affected by landmines and added up the, 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 the numbers there, you wouldn't come to those totals.